Also, you have a ton of interview requests. And they want you on the seventh hour of the Today Show tomorrow morning. Tell them all yes. I'm getting mine, Sari. Also, Pete and Tracy's wives are in your office. Paula is Pete's wife, and Angie is the black one. Okay, and... Sari, I got it. Dr. Liz, we need some advice from the deal breaker lady. I don't know if that's a good idea. I know you, and I know your husband. I just found out Tracy has a secret credit card I didn't know anything about. Not on my watch, Biatch. And he's been using that credit card to pay for a hotel room here in New York two days a week. S that D. Shut it down. Deal breaker. Paula, Pete is refusing to drive to my parents' place for just two weeks of family vacation. No, to the way to the Jose. But Paula, talk it out before you walk it out. And I'm here in New York while he's back in Hoglanda, Veen. Long distance is the wrong distance, Sue. Deal breaker. Mickey Rourke wants to take me camping. Deal breaker, Jenna. God. And I haven't seen my fiance in seven months. Sari, I have two words for you. Robot warning. OK, that catchphrase needs a little work. Deal breaker. Teach it like you preach it, Liz Lemon. <laughs> I almost didn't make it here this afternoon, but then a very special friend of mine showed me the way. So I'd like to take a moment to thank Victor Cordova from the Sunoco station on Lenox Avenue. But there's another reason why I almost didn't come today. Fear. Fear of letting people know the real me. I have but one thing to say to all of you. Be yourself. And I'm talking to you clearly, gay kid. Who told? And you, white kid, just trying to go unnoticed. Oh, come on. Just be yourself, and I guarantee you Every single person in this room will one day be president of the United States. Thank you. Tracy, before you go, I have a special surprise for you. OK, but I'm allergic to horses. It is my pleasure to award you this honorary diploma. Congratulations. <laughs> Take a breath, Mr. Jordan. Ah! Ah!